Okay, so now you should have demo mp3. I've given this to you, and I need you to put it in your folder, the first name, last name, video folder. We're going to import it into Premiere. To do that, you can do the same thing that you did before. You can take it and drag it in if you wanted to, or you can import it. Dragging it in seems to be the most stable way. I'm going to click and drag this down to audio. Now, any music will work, but, you know, it's just one of those things that I just want to show you how to add audio for it. Okay? So, you can pick whatever audio you have or any MP3 laying around. Any MP3 will work. Well, you can fade out music just the same way as you faded video. So what I'm going to do is turn this down just a little bit. And we're going to zoom in. And right here, I'm going to cut off the audio. And I'm going to take the black arrow, delete it out. And right here, I'm going to highlight the audio clip and go to Volume on Effects Control. On Levels, I'm going to put a frame, keyframe here. And I'm going to put another keyframe here at the end. It has to be just at the end, too. There we go. Now with the white arrow, I just drag that down. Well, now it ends with the music. Okay, good stuff. All right, now the last thing I want to show you is title. So let's go to the very beginning and zoom in. We're going to go new title, still image. We'll call title one. And in here, I'm just going to put uh, video by. Okay. Video by. Now, for this, I can choose any title style. Okay. And there's a million title styles. You notice every time I do a title style, things over here change for the uh, title. Okay, And I can't even express how much stuff there is to play around with here. So I would encourage you, encourage you to play around with stuff. Okay. If you need font, um, what type of font family, here's all the font families that you can use. I'm just going to choose one, and I'm going to sit here and put it right about here. Okay. Then I'm going to close this out. I'm going to go right back into it. Well, wow, first off, sorry. I'm going to drag this to video three. Okay. Then right about here, I'm going to go title, new title, default still. This is title 2. That way I can see where title 1 ended. Okay, now I know where to position this with the black arrow. Alright, I'm going to close that out. I'm going to put video or title 2 on video 2. Well, as you can imagine, uh, these can fade into each other. So, all I do is have to go in here, drop that arrow down, and I can see the rubber band, and then I can key it. First highlight it, so you can know that the opacity is being set.
just like that. There we go. One title fades into the next, into the next. So this is multi-track editing. And you can do this with footage also. So if you have one video clip on video one, you can add um, an opacity slider that goes down to video two, and et cetera and so forth. You can have as many video tracks as you want. But I would highly recommend, you know, minimalizing it to about three. Okay. If you want to add a new video track, you simply click in here and say add tracks. It'll ask you, do you want to do it before or after video three? Okay. There's our lame little video. So in the next video, what I want to do is show you how to export the footage.